what's up? <laughs> what's going on, guys? I'm Augustine Versace. This is O'Neill Media. And as always, you are awesome. So there's a lot of things that's been going on with me lately, and I have not been able to give you guys videos like I normally give you guys videos. I've been having a bit of a mental block as of late, and I just want to give you guys three tips to stay more productive when filming for your YouTube channel. One of the biggest things that I've been running into is I'm very uncomfortable shooting anywhere outside of my office. And I'm not talking about projects like shooting a music video or taking pictures or shooting something else for somebody else. I am talking about talking head videos for myself. I have trouble shooting them anywhere else in the house but my office. And as you guys know, we have all been in the house for way too long. I don't want to really be in my office all of the time. So I had to break that mental block of me wanting to shoot a video in my office, but not want to be in my office. So I have worked on other spots in my house that I could actually shoot at. And I've been looking at different lighting setups for the different rooms in my house to be able to have good lighting in those rooms so I could feel more comfortable shooting other rooms. So hopefully that's gonna help me bring more content to you guys. So yeah, that's the first thing. Be comfortable being uncomfortable. Do not have yourself stuck in a situation to where you don't wanna record because you don't feel comfortable. You have to learn how to be comfortable, especially for like me, I'm in my house that I pay for and I'm still uncomfortable. So I have to get over that uncomfortableness, uncomfortableness. Yeah, that's one thing. So during this video, I'm gonna be moving around to different places just to be more comfortable, yeah? On to the next thing. Oh, and before I forget, like, subscribe, ring that bell notification so you can be back for all these new videos that I'm gonna be making very uncomfortably. So the second thing that has helped me be more productive recently when I've not been very productive is learning that the space that I record doesn't have to be the space where I work on what I just recorded. Um, back to my office. I have to work in my office. Yeah, so I can't record and work on my stuff anywhere but my office, especially work on my stuff. Some smells good. What's that? What's up, boy? Hey. <laughs> Say hey to everybody, three. Look, it's people on the other end. Yeah. Ooh, that's you. But it's people on the other end of this. Nah, for real. So yeah, um, for some reason in my mind, when I record something, I have to edit it at home in my office. Nowhere else, just there. If I don't want to be there, then I'm stuck. Just whatever. Um, you don't always have to record and then go straight to work, but try to do it as soon as possible. I guess that's trick number two. Always do it as soon as possible because you're gonna forget where you want to make cut set and everything. And you got something you want to say? No, nah, you want to you wanna say nothing? <laughs> say yeah. All right, so the final tip I got for you guys is don't be afraid to just post it, man. Sometimes in this world, you gotta do things and not be too ready for it. Sometimes you just got to say, you know what, I'm going to post it because I get into the habit of not posting things after I work on things and after I sit on it for like, it's a ridiculous amount of time too. After I sit on it for like a month, I'm like, I don't even know what I want to do with this anymore. I should have just posted it. Oh my goodness, man. So yeah, this is a real quick video, man. Um, Wanted to tell you guys what I've been into lately as far as the jobs that I've been having. I haven't been posting music videos because I haven't been shooting music videos. The last one, um, the last video that I did was for Dirty Money. And no, I take that back. The last video that I did was the P-Talk Freestyle for Blackie. Uh, link up there. And I also did the video right before that was 
lately for Dirty Money. Also another link up there. Check those out. And uh, yeah, man. You just got to be willing to be uncomfortable when you shoot. You got to be willing to shoot anywhere. And you got to be willing to put out what you shoot and not be afraid. You never know. That might be your new biggest thing. And right now, I am really, really, really not doing music videos. What I am doing, though, is a lot more product photography. So within the past month, I have shot for a cosmetic line. I have shot for a cannabis company. I have also shot for a hair company. And product photography is, is amazing, man. I didn't know how, how awesome it was. And a lot of the times I get to combine video as well as photo. And uh, I'm always on the ground with photo, man. There's so many models in Chicago, uh, the Chicago area that I constantly have work for photo. Um, photo wasn't really, photo wasn't what I wanted to do, but over time it's become one of my strong points. And uh, yeah, I just know what I'm into. So that's the video guys. Like, subscribe, ring that bell notification. Also, check out my playlist, man. Go back and look at some of my music videos. Those are cheaters. And I got a couple of tutorials to show you how to shoot music videos behind the scenes, as well as me just going out and setting up some stuff. And I'll probably have something for you in the future. So, peace. Love you guys. Thank you.